everybody keep it going for Shafi Hussein. Let's go! Thank you. Thanks so much. Finally a man, huh? Yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, get these bitches out of my stage, you fuck yeah, dude. I'm kidding, I'm totally kidding. Clap it up for Ali and Brittany, everybody. I knew that's the energy you guys want, but... I gave you the energy you wanted, but that's not who I am, dude. Cool, frat boys up top, love that, dude. That's the kind of energy I give out, you know what I mean? You guys look hot. It's like the one direction of Indianapolis. Yeah, I love that. Good, good vibes. Brazil, are you a soccer fan? Brazil, no. <laughs> Hold on, there's a backstory to it. There's a backstory? We're Let's big, start. Okay, Let's start well, there. What's the back? We're big soccer fans. Our dad told him he looks like Houdini. Our dad? Like me and my brother. Yeah. Okay. okay. <laughs> Our dad told him that he looks like this Your guy. dad told him he looks like Coutinho from Brazil. Exactly. Yeah, and so, then you gifted him that? No, I didn't give him he just, he just bought it. He's like, your dad told me I look like this player, so I need to buy a jersey that looks like him. I listened to your dad, because my dad didn't love me like he should have. So I listened to your dad. I listened to your dad. <laughs> your dad. And how do you how do you how do you know him? How do you know him? Uh, he's my cousin. He's your cousin from in, you guys. He's are, from Arizona. We're from Chicago. Chicago and Arizona. Okay, cool. Do you guys not play soccer at all? I play. Well, I used to. You play soccer. Yeah. So, not, yeah? Not, much not as much. <laughs> soccer has a lot of racism. I don't know if you know this. <laughs> there was a game. This is true. There's like there was a game in 2019 in Italy. During a live game, a, a fan from the stands called a player monkey and threw a banana at the guy. Do you guys know about this? Yeah. Threw a banana at the guy, and the player picked up the banana and ate the banana <laughs> in front of the guy. That's like the biggest, biggest fuck you to the ring. So thank you for some cat. And then he went on to win with his team. That's fucking amazing. After the game was over, the guy who threw the banana, he got arrested. Not for being a racist, but for bringing outside snacks inside the They're like, we don't really sell bananas in this place. How did you get that? We're okay with the reason, but anti-capitalism, not chill, dude. Not chill. I, uh, you guys all like the good-looking people. It's beautiful. It's all, yeah, you guys look beautiful. Yeah, thanks for coming out. Tall kids. What, how tall are you, dude? Six. Fuck. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> What's your name? You have good energy. Sam. Sam. S-A-M? Yes. Beautiful. I'm pretty good at it. That's my crowd work. I spell names. <laughs> um, brothers, cousin, friends, friends of them. Yeah. And you guys like all hang out together? This is scary, This dude. is like a bachelor trip. Bachelor party? Yeah. Who's getting married? This guy right here. Yeah. Do we, we get a shout out for you already? Uh, Clap it up for this guy, dude. Yeah. Is your husband also here tonight? They love this. They love it. Dude. Someone DM me earlier, say this. I'll pay you twenty dollars. Like, I'll do it. I'll do it for ten. I'll do it for ten. <laughs> That's beautiful. And where are you getting married, sir? Uh, in Illinois. Illinois. Shake off your girl. Thank you for expanding on that. <laughs> I said, I want to go. <laughs> and uh, did you meet your significant other at college, somewhere else? Yeah, we grew up together. Grew up together? Yeah. So like a cousin? I'm <laughs> 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 joking. I'm totally joking. Totally kidding. More like, like Topanga and like Corey from like uh, that, that show. What's that show? Yeah, because I grew up in Bangladesh with that shit, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I watched Topanga. I yeah. <laughs> Topanga. The Bengali Topanga. I know about them. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Wait, wait. I'm from Bangladesh. Uh, yeah. Where is it? Where is that? Where do you think it is? <laughs> Somewhere. Yeah, that's a pretty good guess. Yeah. What did you study in college? <laughs> like marketing communications. Marketing and communication. I make content for brands. You make content for brands? Oh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like Oscar Mayer. Oscar Mayer. Never... Oscar Mayer? Okay. <laughs> Hot dogs. I love how you're like. <laughs> <laughs> this show kind of got, I'm sorry to the, everyone else, they love this. You like it? You guys like it too? All right, cool. 
he, he said hot dog like this. Um, I didn't do it. He did it. Did you propose to your uh, fiance in a, in a romantic way? Uh, hell yeah. You, how do you know about this? It's like, it's like hell yeah. I was uh, I was I, I was actually the photographer. I was. Uh, it was on my graduation day. Graduate college? college? How old are you? Uh, 22. Sh why are you doing this to yourself? <laughs> what the fuck? You are handsome. You can't wait. You know what I'm talking about? You know, you, there's, there's plenty of women out there. <laughs> That's good. That's good. And what did you study? Uh, finance. Finance. Yeah, I could have guessed. <laughs> are, you working, are you working in finance? Yeah. What I do you do? Financial advisor. Yeah. What kind of advice would you give uh, me? Oh my God. Retirement. And retirement. Yes. Yeah, you're 22 though. What the fuck do you mean by retirement? He's <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, I know about retirement because I'm 22. <laughs> you should retire now. What the fuck? He's advising people? He's fucking 22. No one takes his advice. He doesn't know shit. He's getting married in 22. Why don't you take his advice? <laughs> Someone who doesn't have a kid, yeah, I'm, I, I advise people on how to have children because I don't have kids. That's what he's doing. And is your uh, fiance also in finance? No, she's in psychology. Psychology. Is she oh. trying to be a therapist? Uh, behavior therapist. With Be kids. Yeah, with, yeah. with kids. Do you mean? <laughs> man, she's gonna. She, she's gonna with kids or for kids? What does that mean? You have to have a kid to go to her. They're like, you gotta come. Timmy, get in here, dude. I cannot go alone. She doesn't see me if you don't. I don't bring one. It's with kids. It's like a dynamic duo. Ashley wants me to bring you. I don't know why. She told me she's only for people with kids. Come on, let's go. Let's go. That's beautiful. Does she have to do like a PhD or like a master's? Yeah, she got her master's. She's she's older. Uh, she's a year older. <laughs> That's great, dude. That's good. And where was the proposal? Where was the proposal? Uh, still you can't be a cougar at 23. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> she's still a leopard, all right? She's still a she's still a cub. Um, she. Where do you, how do you propose? Uh, so it was after my graduation. We went to a park for my personal photo shoot, but it was a surprise to get her there. Yeah, you're like, I'm not gonna hire another photographer. Let's just <laughs> combine it. It's romantic, I promise. He has like a cap with like a drift. It's like, yeah, this is my graduation cap. I love you though. Did you have a picture with your cap on? No. no. That would be so funny, dude. That would be really funny. It's like, oh, it's a high school kid is proposing to his mom. <laughs> He really loves her. This is so romantic. I'm sorry, you're so sweet. What's your name? Oh, my name is Gallo. What? Gallo. Gallo? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Your dad's name is Gallo and his name is also Gallo? How conceited is your dad? Like, what's your name? Sam. He hates you so much. It's like, you're my favorite. You advise people when you're 22. I'm, I'm gonna call you Gallo Jr. And you are sad. You go work for Oscar Myers. You sound just like him. Are you the older or the younger? Are you the older or the younger? I'm the older. Older, yeah. So he fucked with you. Like, <laughs> you guys are very sweet. Thank you for coming. Thank uh, you. How many people are in this group? I feel like there's a good Thirteen ton. Of us. Thirteen of you. All right. Thanks for coming. Clap it up for the group. Yeah. They're so fun. I appreciate you guys coming. Um, I, so, in what's your biggest uh, thing you guys do for fun? Thirteen of you together. Besides this, what are you guys gonna do? Played volleyball for like five hours today. Volleyball for five hours? That's not a brag, right? <laughs> I mean, it was all because this guy's obsessed with it. Like, You're obsessed like, with volleyball? Sports is fun, yeah. Yeah, sports and volleyball. Yeah. Who's, who's the sub? Because like you've played 6v6. One of them. <laughs> you were like out. You're like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he like raised his hand. I was out, dude. He was drinking the beer. I was, I was <laughs> out. Beers, really. What's your name, sir? Right Jake. Jake? Yes, All right, you don't look like a Jake. <laughs> How I do look you... like an Oscar. <laughs> you look like an Oscar. How do you know Gallo? Uh, he's a good friend of mine. 
He's my best friend. He's your best friend? Do you know this? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of pressure, right? Okay. And what about you? Me? Coutinho, yeah. Uh, no, I'm not dating anyone. You're not dating anyone? With that physique and look, how are you not? I know, right? Stand up, stand up for everyone. Stand yeah. up. Stand up. Yeah. Turn around, turn around. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. Now sit down. Now sit down. Why is it hard for you to date or are you just being a fuckboy? What is it? I'm doing engineering school, so it's busy now. So. Are you not do you even graduate yet? Uh, like three weeks. So. Three more weeks. Yeah. Okay. What are you what kind of engineering are you doing? Mechanical at Mechanical. Arizona State. Oh cool. Yeah, I did chemical engineering. That's really? cool. Yeah. Yeah. I would never do that. So Why not? <laughs> Don't like chemistry. You don't like chemistry. No, it's more than chemistry, but I appreciate you. <laughs> like, I would never be able to do it. Are you going to do, what kind of work are you going to do after? Uh, maybe manufacturing. I want to lead project teams. Probably. Manuf cars? Do you want to make cars? Uh, I'm not a car guy, but I could. I what, what would you do? Optimally, anything in the world. Shoot, man. I kind of like workout equipment. Really workout, I can work. tell. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You like to lift heavy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You want to design like workout equipment? I don't know. I did one from like my project design class, like Capstone. Sure. What's your PR bench? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you know. You know your PR. 225. Yeah. 220. That's that's great, dude. That's fucking intense. That's intense. What are you talking about? That's like fucking four blades. What are you? I you know I'm good at math. That's how I got into this. Program. <laughs> I, I went to the gym. Gym culture can be intimidating at times. You know, I remember first day at the gym, this guy looked, he was like huge like you. He, I was like walking past him, he was benching, he was, I was walking past him and he looked at me and he's like, hey, can you give me a spot? He asked me for a spot. He was benching 315 pounds. He asked me for a spot. I was like, hey, I dropped my nephew once, he was 12 pounds. You shouldn't trust me with your life. He wasn't working out to get veins in his neck. I work out because I have love handles, but no one to handle my love. We have different goals. We have different fucking goals, dude. That's a quote. That's a quote. That's a code. You can code that, yeah. Put on a shirt. Market that. Brand market it. I don't know. Put it out there. Um, uh, how, are the, uh, how, are the, how are the engineering girls? Are, have you dated an engineering girl? Yeah. <laughs> he said, I don't touch those. That's what he said. I feel like that's a bigger coat. Engineer. I, I feel weird telling people I studied chemical engineering. Because people, whenever I tell people that at a party, they're like, have you seen Breaking Bad? I'm like, do you think I studied chemical engineering to learn how to make meth? That, I did it to learn how to make bombs. You know? no, they don't. I, I told this joke in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and this sweet lady came up to me after the show. She's like, do you really know? I'm like, yeah. Yeah, like, what engineering school is teaching that course? They're like, welcome to Bomb Making 101. <laughs> this is your professor, Al-Baghdadi. Yeah, we are. <laughs> how, how are you doing on this side? You guys are doing okay? Great. Yeah? Are you guys from this beautiful state? No, we're from Michigan. Michigan, that's also beautiful. All right, you guys. <laughs> You're like, we don't really like it. Are you guys visiting this weekend? Yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Just like for fun? Yeah, well, there's a conference. Conference, yeah. that's fun. What kind? A marriage conference. What the fuck? <laughs> are you guys marriage counselors? What does that even mean? Well, she is a marriage counselor. Yeah. Oh, you are. Okay, so what do you do? Do you help people with like stay in marriages? Yes. Marriage is in crisis, yeah. And crisis. And I also teach Zumba, so your joke was Oh, that's good. I'm glad you like that joke. That's good. You should, yeah. So what about you? Are you guys married? We're married. Yeah. And then when there's a crisis, do you what do you do? <laughs> do you have to like do it yourself or do you call third party? It's <laughs> not a joke. I'm serious. <laughs> What's the last fight you've been on and what did you guys oh do to God. resolve it? The last fight you did. Exam yeah. You know, we couldn't even remember. We were thinking about that. Too. Never had like, a fight. We know what it was, but we don't know what we were yeah, fighting we about. How long have you guys been together? 21 years. Wow. What? Yeah. Zero fights. No, no, we yo, just couldn't remember what it's about. Okay. Kids? Oh, four. Four kids. Wow. Yes. And are they out? Are you empty nesters? Or? No. No, they're no, home. They're, they're, Back home in yeah, Michigan. They're, they're going to be there forever. Forever. Yeah. Why, do you, why do you say that? Well, 
because they're like Gen Z, right? <laughs> I don't know. You you made them. I don't know. <laughs> Why are you looking at me? Like I know about Gen Z. Like I'm the fucking ambassador of Gen. Z. You know Gen Z. They won't leave. <laughs> Do a better job as a dad. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> well, so what do you, what do you do? She, she's a marriage counselor. What about you, sir? Uh, I'm an IT engineer. I, and you're just coming, tagging along with yeah. her. Yeah. yeah. So what do you guys do at a marriage? I don't think anyone knows, and I think everyone is interested. What do you guys do <laughs> in a conference, marriage conference? Like, what is the? Are you guys learning the new tactics on how yeah, to keep too. marriage? New tactics. Right. More blowjobs, less blowjobs. What is it? <laughs> What's the tactic, really? You know what I mean? Like, I speak for everyone. <laughs> Or more head for both ways. I'm not trying to make it, you know, one way. What is the tactic? Yeah, they, well, they just have why are you Why are you fucking talking? It's, she's the marriage counselor. It's like, you see what I have to deal with? That's why I go also teach Zumba, because I can't stand this. <laughs> you guys are so sweet. What, what is the new tactic, miss, really, though? Like, he's about to get married, so, like, we need to learn, you know? G Gallo. Gallo needs to know. Do you want me to start preaching? <laughs> Just summarize, summarize it. We, I, I have to get to more jokes. Just summarize it. It's all about Jesus Christ. Okay. What do you think about that? That's good. That's good. Amen. Okay, I think I'll move on from this. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. If you said Muhammad, I'm like, I'm in! I'm locked in, baby. You're right. The last prophet, the best prophet. <laughs> She's like, no, it's the, it's the middle one. It's the other one. It's the other one. Jesus. Great. So, like, when people come to you, you're like, if, if, they're like, if they're like, you know, a different religion, like, you gotta convert. If you want my help, you gotta switch. I have, I have a friend who was going through a bad breakup and she was explaining the breakup to me, but she misspoke, you know? She's like, Shafi, last week my boyfriend left me out of the blue. I was blindfolded. I'm like, you mean blindsided, right? She's like, oh, right, yeah. Blindsided. But I think it'd be funny if she was blindfolded. So the guy puts a blindfold around her. She's like, ooh, kinky. And then he walks away forever. They're like, where are you going, babe? I love you. They're like, no, you're blindfolded. I'll let you know. Tell that to your friends. Yeah. I'm glad you guys worked it out. That's beautiful. I'm glad you guys worked it out. That's beautiful. How are you doing on this side of the room? You guys are doing good? Are you, are you from this beautiful state? Yes. Yeah. Do you, what do you like about your state? <laughs> Corn and soy. Corn and soy. to like a lot of places. Okay, so you, li you like the ability to go to other places. Yeah, yeah. Like, what I like about my place is that I can go to other places quick. <laughs> That's what I like. It's easy access. Yeah. What do you love about, her, about your wife? Well, I love that she has sisters, and they're nice. <laughs> they're close by, and it's nice. It's a family. <laughs> Were you always religious as a, as a kid? Yeah, yeah. Well, what, what branch? <laughs> Is that not the right way to say it? Yeah. Yeah. There's a, there are branches, right? Yeah. Yeah. Denominations. Denominations. Yeah. It's same fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> what, what is yours? Well, I was raised Methodist. Methodist. What about you, miss? Uh, in a non-denominational church. Uh -huh. So like, you, church. you're like overarching. You're like, I'm the, you, you accept everything. Is that what that means? I'm like trying to learn. I'm not, I'm not joking. I'm serious. Yeah. So do, what do you think about Methodist? Is he a good one or a bad one? <laughs> what is he now? Non-denominational. You, you switch teams? Fuck you, dude. <laughs> Fuck you. Traitor, dude. No, I, I, I love that. That's beautiful. I, I, people, because I have, my parents, they're religious. You know, they're like practicing Muslims. They went to a pilgrimage to Mecca. Do you guys know? Yeah. You guys, Muslims, they go to Mecca, right? Jewish people, they go to Jerusalem. Christians, they go to Coachella. It's a fun place. <laughs> it's a fun place if you can afford it. Definitely do it. You don't date. What about you? I'm not, I'm not dating anyone. 
<laughs> Why did you fumble your words like that? I was expecting. You're not expecting it, yeah. That's fair. Are you in Are you in uh, Indiana? Are you no, zone? I'm also in Chicago. Chicago. What do you do now? I'm in the army. You're in the army. I'll yeah. move on really quick. Okay. <laughs> I went to I went to a school in Massachusetts, and one of the first football games, my university was playing against the army. Yeah, and I was I was freaking out. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, they can just do that? What the fuck? <laughs> if if my school loses, they, do they take over my campus? Like I have a family. <laughs> I was rooting for the army. I'm like, I'm a patriot. Please, please don't take my family. <laughs> what branch of? Are you just like? Are you like? The army. The army. Yeah. And what do, what do you do? What's your position? Do you have a position? Uh, I'm an infantryman. What does it so like the, the boots on the ground like soldiers? The, the, the gun. Have you? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Sorry. yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Have you been? Have you been anywhere? Uh, I've been to Europe. Uh, yeah. Like, during in twenty two when they Russian they, they sent us. Were you in Ukraine? No, no, no. no. What, are, what are you doing in Europe? Uh, we were training Ukrainians. And okay. Just working with uh, all of our NATO allies. Oh wow! Them. Holy shit. <laughs> all the allies? <laughs> all of them? Because we have a lot of allies. We have a lot. We have only a few enemies. A lot of allies. Which, which I like. That should be, you know, that's nice. Um, did you see anyone die? Not there, no. Have you ever seen anyone die? Yeah. Where? Uh, well, my, one, of, one of our guys OD'd and I saw that. In where? One of our guys OD'd. OD'd? Yeah, overdosed. From? Uh, fentanyl. I was talking about like in war. No. Have you seen? <laughs> well, we're partying in Europe and someone od so. You know how it is. The Allies were coming and I was like, fucking get him out of here, dude. He's not supposed to be doing this. I'm sorry, that's fucked up. <laughs> I was like, did you see anyone die in war? I'm like, we party hard and that happens at times. We party hard, is that something? You count that as something? <laughs> That's fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> um, do you do you do fentanyl? <laughs> have you tried it? Yeah. What's the hardest drug you have tried? Uh, none. None? You don't do anything. I'm, I'm not part of the. I'm not gonna tell anyone. <laughs> no, I don't. Do you, you drink? Is that what it is? Drink, yeah. Just the drinking. That's all it is. Yeah, that's good. Good boy, right there. <laughs> good boy. Um, I, uh, I I never drank. I never drank. I've always been like very worried about drinking because like when I was young, I uh, in my in Bangladesh, I had like a distant relative who like passed from secondhand smoking, and that kind of scared the shit out of me. You know, secondhand dying from secondhand smoking is so unfair. You didn't even get to enjoy it. You know what I mean? That's like if your roommate hooked up every night and you died of a STD. I'm like, what are the fucking chances, dude? I didn't even get to do it. What's my problem? Fuck. Um, so in the army, you don't. Are you not allowed to date in the army? You can. You just choose not not to. Yeah, never tried. Never tried I've, it. I've tried. When you're in Europe, are you trying to like get some? We weren't allowed to go anywhere. Shut up, really. <laughs> we had to stay on like on base for pretty much the entire time. And is that is that why you guys did fentanyl or like? Oh, <laughs> it's just it's boring as yeah. shit. You guess? How did you get fentanyl in the U.S. <laughs> Army base, dude? That's fucking that's fucking crazy. Easier than you think. All right. Um, <laughs> I feel like we should not be doing that, right? Uh, is that how the U.S. Army wins, you think? They just all are fucking drugged up with fentanyl? Or like, what about you, sir? Are you dating? No. No? Uh, are you also in the Army? No. What do you do? I'm in finance. Finance. Nice. Finance, what, what, finance bros. I like that. <laughs> and are you in the state of Indiana? No, I'm in uh, Chicago. Chicago. You guys are like boys from work. Yeah. 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 Is that how you guys met? No, we were friends since we were like five. Five? You know everyone from five. <laughs> Seems like it. Yeah, you're like, I'm done, I'm 22, I'm done, dude. Let's get married, I have all my friends, I'm done. Nothing new in my life, please. I don't like it, too much changes. And you're not dating in Chicago, it's a big city. No? Going on dates? No, I'm too busy. 
Too busy with finance? <laughs> Just making money? What kind of finance do you do? Also, I'd advise. Personal finance, but I'm on more of the operations side. Operations of finance. Okay. <laughs> and you don't have any time to date. That just do you, what do you do for fun? Uh, MMA. MMA. Yeah. What kind of group is this? <laughs> we have one army man, one MMA fighter, <laughs> one marketing guy, one who looks like Coutinho from Brazil. <laughs> What's the fuck? The most random assortment of guys. One guy who doesn't even get to play volleyball. Like, I'm out. I'm out. I'm not. I'm out. One old dude. He's like he's the oldest one here. He's a brother-in-law. <laughs> brother-in-law what about you when so you were like part of the family yeah yeah when did this happen uh 10 years ago 10 years ago yeah. did you propose romantically uh, I, no, not, at <laughs> not at all no. what did you do at our uh, well I, su I surprised my wife because she she likes to like kind of dig it and uh surprises she, and things. So she, she likes figured, she figures things out like really easily sure so i had to keep everybody out of it yeah i just showed up at her door yeah yeah, yeah. and you did it no big speech, just like, will you? Yeah, and then yeah. she slammed the door in my face. <laughs> no. Yes! She didn't say yes? She opened the door up again, and then she went, did you ask my dad? <laughs> and oh, I was like, shut up, are you serious? Yeah, I did, and then she was like, and then she said yes. <laughs> oh, so if, if you hadn't, she would say no, you think? I don't know. I don't know. Yes. Yeah? yeah. <laughs> what, what's your ethnicity? What is it? Ecuadorian and Cuban. And it's like, a, do you, ha you have to get permission from the parent first? Oh, is that a... For like... Oh, for yeah. the marriage. Yes. Oh, 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 I thought you were talking about like, all right, let's... Let's No. <laughs> That's it's what it sounds like. Yeah. Is that a thing? That's a thing. Yeah, 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 of course, of course. What are you? I'm Italian and English. Yeah, you, you're like, I'm not going to say I'm, white. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I'll just give you the descriptors and you can do the math. Add it up. Add it up. He's an honorary Latino. Is He's he? An honorary Latino. Yeah, yeah, with the... Hat. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got it. Have you guys? Have you been to your country? Uh, no, man. No, no, it's actually a dream of mine. Never. It's a dream of mine. It's Quito, probably first. Okay. Quito, Ecuador. Never. Never been Ecuador. Never. Okay, never. Okay, cool. Um, that's cool. That's cool that you have to ask for permission. That's nice. My, uh, cause like in Saudi, it's like a similar kind of vibe. My dad wants to like pick out my spouse. They're like, I'll pick you, I'll pick out something for you. <laughs> yeah, I was like, last time I was in Bangladesh, I sent my dad to get get some like seedless grapes from the store. He came back home with grapes that had seeds in it. I'm like, I'm not gonna trust you with my wife. <laughs> He's like, uh, Shafi, there's your wife. I'm like, uh, she's already pregnant, and uh, that's not my seed. That's someone else's seed. I don't like this. 